Welcome to Bosco Mind, YouTube's street mentalism show. Some time ago, one of you gave me the idea to present to you all the process how we record the street magic and street mentalism. So this is what I'm going to show you today. There are a few things which you need to take into consideration when recording your street performance. First of them is to prepare the crew. Decide whether you want to use one or two cameras. If you have two cameras available, you can record the general picture with one of them and the details with the others. With two cameras you will be able to show precisely the reaction of your spectator when it comes. Before you go to the streets, speak to those who will record you. Explain to them your routine and what do you want them to catch at each moment. This will allow you to show your effect in the most appealing way. Finally, avoid changing your crew. If you record different performances with the same cameraman, you see that over time everything will go very smoothly. Now just a few words about the technical stuff. First of all, the camera. HD camera is always a good choice. Nowadays you can probably record the high quality footage even with your mobile. Since the streets are very noisy, it's good to use a clip microphone. It will reduce the unwanted sounds. If your camcorder doesn't have a microphone input, use the digital recorder. You can combine audio with video later on. Keep the microphone hidden until the moment of recording. Record your video when the light is good. Avoid evenings, unless the place which you choose is well lit. It's important to choose the right venue for the recording of your performance. The best place is the one where people come to chill and relax. Look for the crowded streets with lots of tourists. Parks are also a nice alternative. And now we come to the probably one of the most important elements. How to approach the people to record your effect. First of all, don't go together with your crew. Even if it's just one cameraman, keep the distance. People you're going to approach should have no idea that you're planning to record anything at this stage. Look for the people who seem to be relaxed or having fun. Don't approach just anyone. Bigger groups are always better. While you might feel more nervous when performing in front of a bigger group, they are always more likely to accept you since they feel more secure. And more spectators on your video is also better for the aesthetic reasons as well. If there is a couple, start performing first for the men. Establish good rapport, be kind and friendly. This way when you start performing later for the girl, he will react nicely. If you change the order, you might often find that the men will try to spoil your performance. Start by saying something like, excuse me, can I show you something? Be kind and friendly. Don't bring your cameraman yet. You need to establish authority first. Keep your desired effect for the end. Choose some strong material and begin with it. You see that with each effect your audience will react more and you will establish a better report. Finally, when you see that they are comfortable with you and still looking for more, casually ask if you can record one trick. Once they say yes, invite your crew which should be around already. Bring out your clip microphone and you're ready to go. Don't say goodbye after you finished. Ask them to share their thoughts about your performance to the camera. For some people, this will be the moment when they start to react even stronger. The last stage is the post-production. Spend good amount of time editing your video. Make sure you get the best out of the footage that you have. And now for the results of the last deck giveaway. Here is the winner. And there is a new deck giveaway, it's on my Facebook, all the details are there, you can win very easily the bicycle deck of cards. This concludes also the second season of the Bosco Mind, thank you very much for sticking with me for all this time, and there are new exciting things coming in two weeks time, something very interesting to show you. See you!